Hello patrons, today I'm going to show you three methods for flattening a cymbal. If I press over here, nothing. If I press here, yeah, there's definitely a gap between the surface and the cymbal. And it starts touching the surface around here. I'm going to draw on the cymbal in Sharpie so I know that my problem zone is in there. I like to just think about where that relates to on the bell and then turn the cymbal over. It can be as simple as this, one hammer stroke. Another one, I've got these pipe grips, which I use for lots of things in cymbal making. It's actually grab where your problem area is. And sometimes, well in this case, you can see that bit is actually now pretty much flush. Method number three, and I like to use one of these. Again, pressure with that hand. It sounds quite severe and it is quite severe, so you need to be a bit careful. Already, that is much closer to the surface. 